we have a very complex environment and it's made even more complex by housing eight bears on it. So we try and give them full access inside, outside and to each other at all times. This encourages them to create social bonds and to work things out and it gives them time to just be bears. We've got two bears here being very cute and very sociable with each other. One of the things that we were really surprised by and continue to be uh, awed by is the way that these bears can create very complex social relationships with each other. Over time, as we've added bears, we've seen all sorts of personalities come together and, and learn how to live together. Bears have really large personalities and living with seven other polar bears can be challenging at times. We have one bear here and he's a very special bear. He's our mentor bear. His name is Storm. And when he came to us, he was three years old. And because he was a little bit older than the 10 months that we got all of our other bears in at, all of our other rescues, he had actually learned an awful lot about being a bear out in the wild. And what he has done is he's brought a, a calm and a centering personality, for the most part, to this group. He has taught bears how to interact together appropriately. He's broken up arguments. Uh, and he's always got a watchful eye on the rest of the group. Recently, we've had some uh, of our younger bears that have been stretching their wings a little bit, maybe maybe trying to take over the field and, and being a little bit more assertive than they have been in the past. And what we've noticed is Storm spends a lot of time with these bears one-on-one, -on -one, where he'll just sit in a very similar fashion to what we have here and socialize with them, interact with them, and we find that, that it's making them more responsible at, at being bears in a large group, which is really cool. I would think the best bear friends that we have here are Casca and Aurora. They're so inseparable that we often refer to them as sisters, even though they are not genetically related. You always find those two together. We find uh, them sharing food, sharing beds, sharing space all the time. Now that we've introduced another young female into the group, uh, we find that she's slowly getting taken in by uh, Casca and Aurora, and she's becoming part of a three group uh, of very tight-knit friends. For me, the most interesting thing about this position has been the ability to learn about the personalities of so many bears and to watch them develop and to watch the interactions that happen between the animals. So far, along with our care, but more importantly, Storm's contribution to uh, being the dad of the group and making sure that everybody gets along, it's really been enriching uh, for me. Uh, to see how these bears have developed and, and come so far in uh, what is a pretty short period of time.